This is James Hilder for iFold TV in association with Macca's Jim Marbella. We've got the bomber Adam Etchis. We're in Sheffield today. A little while since we've had him on the channel, so I thought we'd uh, take a moment to catch up with you, Ad. What's happening? Um, nothing much. I think everyone thinks I've disappeared and I've retired or I'm not doing anything anymore. Um, Can you confirm you're still actively fighting and I'm, or what's going on, more to the fact? I'm still actively fighting. I'm still doing everything I was doing before. I've just I've had a bit of a, a bit of a strange year, I have. Um, yeah. 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 I'll obviously, I'm a defeat, which l it happens, it's just boxing. Cracking fight against Kamitsky, I've got to say, yeah, from I'm a neutral point of view, what a good fight to watch. I was ready to, to, to jump straight back in and get straight back on ladder. Um, then I ended up with copy for an injury, mm -hmm. um, and then I've just had an operation um, a month ago. Do you want so, to tell me what the operation was? Um, no, <laughs> all I can tell you is I've, de I've had an operation and it's, and it's very painful. Yeah, but it wasn't life-threatening? It weren't life-threatening, no, but it's, it's slowed me down um, massively. It's like a um, game of Cluedo. Yeah, that's what it is. <laughs> I got a, a, a nice fight in Monte Carlo penciled in. Um, I've had to pull off that. That was in November, wasn't it? November 7th, yeah. yeah. Um, I'm really looking forward to that, both the fight and going over and, and seeing the place. Um, but, you know... This year has been a bad year. Like I said, I got with defeat and injuries and operation and everything else. Lost my granddad. Just, just a bit of a crap year. Sorry to hear that. Mate. It's all right. It's, it's, it's life, isn't it? But um, next year will be. I think next year will be my year. You know, he's plenty of good middleweights. Watch you bank again tonight. Hopefully, he does business and keeps winning. He he, he got beat against Billy Joe Saunders and he's he's flying now and coming back back up there. So. You know, all fighters get beat. It's just it's how you come back from it. And I'm, I'm like I said, next year I'm looking forward to getting my head down and kicking on. You know, the, the division at the moment is alive as well. You just mentioned Eubank in action tonight. Obviously, he's facing Spike O'Sullivan as well on December the 12th. Are they the sort of fights you want to be involved in? 150%. If I didn't want to be in them, then I wouldn't do them. It was like when I when I fought Kaminsky, people said, "Oh, why did you fight him? I didn't need to fight him." But I do need to fight him. I need you need to fight people like that, you know, to to progress. Um, and he were, you know, I had it all. I had it all on a plate for me. All I had to do was beat him, and then I would have been in a good place. Unfortunately, I lost. I've had to go back to the drawing board. But I know that I'm a better. I am a better fighter than Kamitsky. Just on the night, it be the better man won, and you know, fair play to him. I, I'm not gonna make excuses up or say this or say that, but I definitely want to be in big fights, you know, win, lose or draw. The the big nights and the big fights, that they're what I want. We want to see you back in, in them big fights as well, because obviously we've followed your career for so early on, it seems like for the last six months we ain't heard nothing of you, so it's good to see you back and see what's going on and you're in the gym and this and that, you know? Yeah, that's it. Another reason, I don't, I don't like coming to stuff because for the reason being, you know, I, Everyone's asking me the same thing, oh, when you're fighting, and it's, the answer is, I don't know. Um, it will be after Christmas now because, like I said, I've got to wait for this to heal up yeah. um, and, and, and get back on and kick on. But just echoing what I've already said, I'm really looking forward to next year, getting my head down, changing things around a bit and kicking on and progressing and climbing that ladder. All right, well, listen, I look forward to seeing you back in action. Said thank you for talking to our TV and give our regards to Richard Poxon. Yeah, as well. I will do. Thanks, James. Top yeah. man, I'll see you soon. Cheers.